light. Yeah. Okay. Hi everyone. This is Anu here. Is there anyone there? Anyone joining in? Um. Yeah, a few people are joining in. Oh, hi. <laughs> Yeah, now there are 30 or so people. Hi everyone, this is Anu here. My name is Anu Rao. I'm a home baker. Um, I haven't done uh, any professional baking. I do it for friends and family, of course. Um, <laughs> all my family is here to uh, support me. And thank you all for you know being online at this hour. I know it's kind of late over there. Uh, I'm sure uh, some of you must be staying up uh, you know, to see this live. Thank you so much. Um, well, for all of you who have joined in and uh, those who are joining in now, thank you again. Amul, I want to thank you for this opportunity. I have never done this before. Uh, this is really really nice of them to have this confidence in me to uh, have a live for uh, the greatest and the you know longest running online la live uh, show thank you so much uh, you okay. guys must be wondering why am i wearing an apron that says world's greatest baker well my family gifted this to me my family in london think i'm good <laughs> so that's the reason why i'm wearing it thank you for your uh, encouragement because that's what keeps me going so if there are enough of uh, us online shall we start with the recipe yeah so what are you making today everyone's asking oh uh, today uh, we have a marriage here between um, brownies and cookies i am making uh, brookies over here this is what our end result is going to be like but uh, of course, this is going to be a very uh, decadent, very yummy, gooey cookie, which you can, um, you know, cook up in a jiffy. Today is World Baking Day and uh, Amul wanted me to bake something with chocolate. So I decided this is something that doesn't take very long. It uh, can be made in 15, 20 minutes. And that's what I'm going to attempt uh, today. Um... First of all, I am going to preheat my oven. So I'm going to start it at 180 to 190 degrees. Right. And let's get started with mixing all our ingredients. And while all of this is getting done, we have our uh, oven getting heated up. Right. Um, I am going to melt our amul butter over here i'm gonna just warm it up in the microwave for 30 seconds and then start working with it i'm also using amul chocolates over here in our recipe today and uh, as you all know amul makes really really good uh, chocolate, I've been using these chocolates for all my desserts, whether it's cakes, ice creams, um, cookies. Uh, it's the best chocolate that I can find, whether it is compound or coverture. So if you haven't tried already, you should look out for all of these uh, different flavors of Amul chocolates, which you can use. Uh, and some of these have been used by me in recipes which are on our youtube channel uh, if you don't know it is called the chefpreneur i would uh, you know put the link over here for all of you to follow and uh, to tell you the truth the recipe for brookies is also on our youtube channel and if there is any step that you miss out you are most welcome to go there and uh, find it on our YouTube channel and you know look up the recipe okay so our butter is nice and much melted let's get it into our bowl okay. 
there goes our butter in here and I am going to whip up our sugar which is one and a half cups and let's just give it a nice mix there you go see the butter and the sugar has mixed up really well you can actually use brown sugar also if you don't have white sugar uh, any sugar actually granulated or fine or brown is fine uh, a lot of people like to use brown sugar which is healthier and that's great too okay so while this is gonna be mixed I'm gonna heat up our chocolate now the best way to do it is on a double boiler but that takes a little longer and because you know we're trying to hurry things up I'm gonna put this in the microwave and I'm gonna do it with 30 second intervals there abhi ye 30 seconds ke liye humne dal diya hai microwave mein अगर आपके पास हैंड ब्लेंडर है यू नो यू कुड यूज दैट दैट मेक्स इट फास्टर एंड ऑफ कोर्स इट विल बिकम फ्लफियर एज वेल बट आई डोंट हैव अ हैंड ब्लेंडर एट द मोमेंट तो इसलिए हम हैंड विस्क ही यूज कर रहे हैं इट्स परफेक्टली फाइन टू यूज वट एवर यू हैव गिव मी अ सेकेंड आई गोट चेक ऑन माई चॉकलेट I need to put it in for another 30 seconds. This is soft yet not uh, melted. While the chocolate is getting done, I'm going to add the rest of our ingredients one by one. This is one teaspoon of vanilla essence and also one teaspoon of salt I'm not putting too much salt here because I have used salted butter I have hai. let's go check on the chocolate Almost done. Oh, okay. Let me show you what it looks like. I still need to put it for 30 more seconds. Ye dekhiye. Puri tarah melt nahi hua hai. So, let's put it in. Okay, someone's asking instead of butter, can I use ghee? Ah, amul ghee. Ah, use kar sakte hai? Kyun Of course, we can use uh, amul ghee as well. <laughs> uh, usually, uh, you know, butter hota hai, lekin jiske paas butter nahi hai, wo thik hai. Lekin margarine nahi use kariyega. Let's not uh, use uh, uh, artificial flavoring in here. It's best to use butter or ghee. So, here is our melted chocolate. Ye dekhye. Can you see? So, this is why you can use the amul chocolate. Use kar sakte hai. Perfect. Okay, now I am going to add my eggs to this. Let me whip up. This is egg white. I have two egg whites. I will add karungi one more egg. Just one whole egg will go in here. If you have eggless banana, then you can make it uh, eggless by adding milk. Amul milk, hai na? 
ताज़ा वाला परफेक्ट होएगा इसके लिए फॉर द एगलेस रेसिपी बस क्वांटिटी इतनी ही होनी चाहिए वी नीड टू हैव द सेम अमाउंट ऑफ लिक्विड नॉट टू मच ऑफ इट ज़्यादा लिक्विड नहीं होना है दिस वंस यू सी द डो यू नो व्हाट आई मीन इसका कंसिस्टेंसी यू नो इट हैज टू बी जैसे आटे का डो होता है क्वाइट फॉर्म See here, we're gonna add our eggs. ये देखिए शुगर भी डिजोल्व हो गई और दिस इज हाउ द बटर एंड द एग विल लुक एट दिस पॉइंट अब इसमें हम एक एक करके बाकी इंग्रेडिएंट्स डाल सकते हैं Let's start with the chocolate. Our melted chocolate, which is going in here. Ah, that's the beep of my oven. Garam ho gaya hai. It's ready to take in these. Um, cold milk or warm milk as a substitute. Ah, uh, room temperature would be best. जैसे हम अंडे रूम टेम्परेचर पे लेते हैं बटर भी रूम टेम्परेचर लेते हैं बेकिंग के लिए इट्स ग्रेट टू यूज मोस्ट थिंग्स एट रूम टेम्परेचर वी कैन ऑलवेज हीट इट अप इफ रिक्वायर्ड लुक एट दिस दिसमी चॉकलेट अमूल के चॉकलेट की बात ही कुछ और है आई हैव टू सेव इट फ्रॉम माई किड्स मैं लेकर आती हूँ बेकिंग के लिए और पता चले आधा इन लोगों ने खा लिया ओके नाउ वी गो पुट इन आर अदर ड्राई इंग्रीडियंट्स ये मैदा है आई हैव वन कप ऑफ फ्लावर ओवर हियर ऑल पर्पज फ्लावर या एक्चुअली आई एम गो स्टार्ट फोल्डिंग इट इन बिकॉज वी आर डन विद विस्क ये अब हमारे ड्राई इंग्रीडियंट्स जब आ रहे हैं तो वी नीड टू एड इट इसमें अब पड़ेगा कोको पाउडर वी हैव हाफ अ कप ऑफ कोको पाउडर हेयर दे यू गो अब आप देखेंगे जब ये मिक्स हो जाएगा इसकी कंसिस्टेंसी कैसे हो जाती है इट लुक लाइक लावा मेक श्योर टू मिक्स इट प्रॉपरली दे शुड नॉट बी बिट्स ऑफ ड्राई फ्लावर और कोको पाउडर इन हियर अगर आपके पास हैंड ब्लेंडर है मिक्सर है तो उससे भी जल्दी हो जाता है हाउ डू यू स्टोर दीज ब्रुकीज ओह वेल यू कैन लीव इट इन एन एग टाइट कंटेनर आउटसाइड इट डजेंट हैव टू बी रेफ्रिजरेटेड आपको फ्रिज में रखने की ज़रूरत नहीं है एक हफ्ते तक तो चलेगा बट हमारे घर में एक हफ्ते कैसे कुकीज लास्ट कर सकते हैं मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम दे गेट ओवर एंड जस्ट टू डेज तो यू नो इट डिपेंड्स ऑन द साइज ऑफ द कुकीज अगर आप छोटे बनाने चाहते हैं तो देन यू कैन मेक अप टू अ डजन स्मॉल कुकीज विद दिस लेकिन हम लोग थोड़े से बड़े साइज के बनाते हैं एज यू कैन सी द साइज ओवर हियर एंड इन दिस अमाउंट ऑफ डो विल हैव अबाउट एट टू टेन बिग कुकीज Now my last ingredient is going to go in, which is the chocolate chips. Once it has mixed thoroughly, I'm putting in. Again, Amul has really good chocolate chips, uh, chocolate uh, bits that you can use. Milk flavor में होते हैं. They are. Uh, there you go. See, this is the thickness of the dough. And 
एट दिस टाइम यू डोंट इवन नीड टू रेफ्रिजरेटेड अगर आपका डो बच जाता है यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू बेक ऑल ऑफ इट इन वन शॉट देन श्योरली यू कैन रेफ्रिजरेट द डो इट विल कम आउट रियली वेल द नेक्स्ट डे इज वेल बट दिस इज द कंसिस्टेंसी दैट वी आर लुकिंग फॉर राइट um can we replace maida with whole wheat flour um i would not suggest that you do you can substitute it with corn flour because i know that uh, corn flour has a good uh, flavor when you come make it with the uh, uh, chocolate especially if you're adding cocoa powder to it but uh, you know just to make it healthier i would not recommend using uh, whole wheat or atta um can we make it in the microwave um i have never tried making it in the microwave but yes uh there are quite a few people who use microwave for uh, with convection and because these brookies take very little time sirf 10 minute lagta hai oven mein to aap bana sakte hain um no harm trying <laughs> and you know there was this friend of mine who asked me कि आई एम नॉट वेरी फॉन्ड ऑफ डार्क चॉकलेट तो ये जो ब्रुकीज हैं कैन वी मेक इट विद वाइट चॉकलेट एंड आई सेड एब्सोल्यूटली यू नो अमल ऑल्सो मेक्स रियली गुड वाइट चॉकलेट सो इफ यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू यूज डार्क चॉकलेट यू कैन यूज बिट्स ऑफ वाइट चॉकलेट एंड इट विल टेस्ट अमेजिंग इट विल हैव दिस रियली नाइस मार्बल इफेक्ट प्लीज डू ट्राई दैट इज वेल सो लेट्स स्पून दीज आई एम यूजिंग just one tablespoon and i'm using the same foil that i used for making my previous batch we'll put just four in here at the moment because ye bade bade hain ye kafi expand karega after we have baked them and i'm just putting big डॉलप्स ऑफ वेट ये अपने आप ही मेल्ट करके फ्लैटन हो जाते हैं यू डोंट हैव टू फ्लैटन दैम लाइक चॉकलेट चिप कुकीज कैन यू सी इफ यू लाइक मोर चॉकलेट चिप्स प्लीज फील फ्री टू एड दैम ऑन टॉप ऊपर चॉकलेट चिप्स अगर लगाएंगे तो वो भी होएगा मजेदार वाइट चॉकलेट चिप्स भी आते हैं यू कैन Uh, put a few sprinkle white chocolate chips on top, and that would be nice as well. Okay, some people are asking for the full recipe. Um. Well, we'll go over it uh, in a minute. I'm going to put it in the oven, but you can also refer to our YouTube channel. Uh, we have the Brookies recipe on there. Please go look it up, and you'll find the exact. amount of ingredients that you require and the method so i'm going to put these in the oven for 10 minutes my oven is at uh, 180 degrees centigrade and there goes my timer for 10 minutes okay so if any other questions are there please feel feel free to ask uh anything else that you would like to know um there is the link down there for our youtube channel and uh, you can have a look at the recipe for brookies over there mm. any questions for me would anybody you know like to know anything else about the method um how much milk like in grams or um I would say uh, when we measured our eggs in ml, it was about um, half a cup. So the same amount of milk would be great. Don't go for more than half a cup because then you know that the dough will become very runny. Or फिर अगर वही हो जाता है अगर आपको लगता है कि dough बहुत पतला है तो उसमें और आपको flour add करना पड़ेगा. You'll have to put more uh, all-purpose flour. to get it the right consistency so it's best to start with less milk and gradually add one by one as in one tablespoon at a time if you feel that the consistency is not right can we make it in the air fryer ah uh, i don't think so uh the fryer is a air fryer is a substitute for frying this is baking 
So you need to put it in an oven or an OTG. Um, I know friends of mine who have used the pressure cooker for making cookies. And uh, that's an option. If you don't have an oven, if you want to try it in the pressure cooker, uh, please go ahead. I, I would not be able to help you because I have never pressure cooker in pressure cooker. So I don't have idea how much time to keep it. But I know there are uh, people out there who have tried it. <laughs> okay. um, how was your experience in starting a bakery in USA? Ah, okay, so we haven't really started a bakery. I'm a very humble home baker. I make it for my family and friends. I have uh, no idea how you have to go about in terms of you know applying for paperwork. I'm sure there is... Uh, you know, some uh, course that you might have to do, in which case you will have to get some uh, uh, certification, some paperwork would be required. Um, we have a bakery in India because I started uh, this uh, back home and it really started a year ago, not even a year ago, because uh, during the pandemic, I wasn't able to get uh, things from outside. Pehle bhi baking kar rahi thi, lekin uh, jab ghar mein shortage hui, tabhi humne apne aap breads and bagels and uh, you know cookies and all uh, banane shuru kare. Now I uh, started this at home, and for heaven's bake is our bakery uh, in India where I have taken orders for friends and I have you know sent out uh, these cookies and cakes, but in the US, I am yet to, uh, you know, make orders for friends. Okay, so if there aren't any more questions, I'm going to show you what our uh, rookies are going to look like on the inside. Now, when we're looking for this, it has a nice crust on the outside, just like a cookie. But when we break it, it has the texture of a brownie on the inside it's very soft and gooey and so so yummy and all these chocolate pieces these uh, chocolate chips that melt on the inside it gives it a very uh, flowy like a chocolate lava cake kind of a feel Dekhye. so it's got a really nice uh, texture mm. just like a brownie <laughs> um, can you explain about the temperature settings in the oven? Does it depend on the consistency of the batter? Mm. Actually, the oven settings vary from oven to oven. So, 180 to 190 is what is required. If you feel that your uh, oven cooks things really fast, that only you would know, you should check on the uh, cookies at about eight minutes um, right now I have six minutes left over there so at eight minutes I'm gonna see what the cookie looks like from outside um, when when we take it out I'll show you it has to have a nice exterior which is fully cooked yet the center of it will be really soft like that of a brownie but as we let it cool for about 10 minutes, it will get the uh, consistency right. On the inside, it will cook slowly. And uh, you know, you have to wait uh, like most cookies or brownies for that matter. <laughs> you have to wait before you can actually go bite into them. Any other questions for me? Five more minutes in the oven. Anybody wants the recipe again? Um, yeah, there are people asking for the recipe, the written recipe. The written recipe. So uh, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put in our YouTube uh, link to the particular recipe, to our Brookie's recipe. And... Uh, Immediately after the live, you will be able to go over there and have a look 
at the exact ingredients and uh, the amounts over there um okay so someone wants to learn variety of chocolate recipes okay so uh, that's great there are um like i said amul has a lot of chocolates it has uh, kvetcher as well as compound chocolates which i have used for cakes for chocolate lava cake uh, the recipe again is there on our youtube channel um i make a lot of cakes and uh, the brownies that we have made earlier uh, again the link is there uh, in our uh, channel we we make a lot of uh, products i make chocolate ice cream and uh, all of these are there so please subscribe to our channel please have a look at all the recipes over there which include chocolate and of course i'm going to keep making them so if you turn on the notifications after subscribing you'll know when our uh, next video goes out um we try and post uh, one video every week and uh, we already have uh, over 100 videos over there quite a few uh, have chocolate in them not only chocolate for that matter uh, uh, my husband cooks a lot he's the chef of the family i just do a little bit of baking here and there so he uses a lot of amul products as well and uh, i have to admit i use a lot more <laughs> i have loved amul ever since uh, i was a child i used to look forward to those uh, quirky ads that would come out har uh, hafte har uh, do hafte mein there used to be these wonderful ads that amul would come out with <laughs> and we all have childhood memories of those right um what's your youtube channel it's called the chefpreneur uh the link of it would be here on our uh, comments um okay can we use cacao nibs uh yes we can um again it depends on the uh amount of cocoa it has um i prefer to use something that has 60 to 70% uh, uh cocoa because then it has that nice dark color of course when you use brown sugar you also get a little bit of uh, additional color because of that um and uh, for sure the chocolate chips are perfect uh, in this i'm just going to have a quick look at the rookies in here okay so it's almost done but not done as yet i can see that uh, the center needs another minute so i'm going to close it and then as soon as the timer goes off we shall take them out what is the name of the bakery in india it's called for heaven's bake <laughs> my daughter decided on the name <laughs> okay um what have you made um for uh, for the bakery um today what have you made oh okay so we have brookies over here this is uh, what we have made and i'm going to take out the fresh brookies from the oven there you go can you see oh Look at that. Oh wow. Mm. So I'm sure you can see the crackle on the sides. Can you see the edges? That's the crackle that we want of a brownie as well as a cookie. Now as we let it cool in the next few minutes it will start getting harder in the center right now it's still very soft um can you see how soft it is yeah but we're going to let it say, sit and in a few minutes it will harden to a point where it will be you know easy to come off the foil right now we wouldn't touch it for another 5 to 10 minutes
Okay, um, more people are asking about the name of the YouTube channel. Uh, the YouTube channel's name is The Chefpreneur. That's where we have all our uh, recipes. The recipe of the brookie is also over there. We also have uh, a small group of uh, friends that is on the recipe exchange. But if you can, please go to our YouTube uh, link and have a look at the recipes over there. Thank you so much. It's been such a pleasure uh, making these brookies for all of you. Uh, thank you, Amul, once again for uh, inviting me here tonight. And I hope all of you are going to enjoy making these at home. Thank you so much. Stay, stay safe. Bye-bye.